Thank you very much. Hello and welcome back to the channel. So, today we're mixing things up. We're going to try and keep things fresh, keep things alive. I've set myself a little challenge. Um, basically what I've done, can't believe I've done this, but I have. So we're going to have to go with it. I have bought one of these. Focus, there we go. So that is a photography lens ball set. Um, it says, put the world into a ball. Uh, don't know, yeah, we'll try, we'll try that. No, without a certain gentleman on YouTube, his name is Chris, and his channel is Chrisography Studios. Go check him out, give him some love. Without him, I wouldn't know what this is. Um, I would just tell you it's a crystal ball, and I've got no interest in impersonating Mystic Meg, so I'm not going to go near it. Um, but since following his content, since watching his videos, and I'd say, at least as a viewer, it looks like the lens ball is one of his signature moves, uh, signature pieces, so yeah, I really got interested in this um, from watching his stuff, and I just thought, give it a go, what have you got to lose, really? Uh, it's an affordable bit of kit, I suppose. Um, not expensive at all, cost me about £20, so all good there. In terms of an unboxing, I mean, it, it arrived very well, Amazon, next day, Prime, blah, 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 uh, a couple of really nice pouches, so all good there. And yeah, basically the plan is to head to a local spot, um, Longwood Nature Reserve has featured in a couple of my videos. Um, so yeah, I've got a couple of ideas in mind. We're staying local. We are going to go with the Canon M6 Mark II and the 16mm lens made by Sigma, um, which was like a really good pairing. Um, I used it in my, not my last video, but the video before that, um, in, uh, in my local park and golf course. And it was a really good pairing, it was a really good setup. And yeah, that's what we're going to do. You're going to see some POV style footage. I'll try and keep it short and sweet, try not to bore you with it. Um, but I thought it would be an interesting idea to see how I'm going to go about, hopefully, composing a decent photograph. And I thought the best way of sharing that with you was to have the action camera mounted on, a, mounted on my chest. So let's get out there and have some fun. back and that was fun I have to say that was really really good um, I, I think the next time I don't know when that's gonna be it will feature in more of my videos because I did have a really really enjoyable experience um, and challenge as well so it will feature in more videos of mine that's assured I think the next time that I do it I don't know when that's gonna be but the next time that I do it I think I'm gonna use a tripod and a remote trigger um, only because, only because, it was quite a challenge to not end up with this ugly mug in it. Um, yeah, round, glass, reflective. I should have probably seen that coming. Um, so yeah, next time, 
you know, I won't beat, my, beat myself up too much. Uh, first time I've used one, so I'll, I'll forgive myself. I won't beat myself up too much for that. Um, but having said that, I mean, I think probably my favourite photograph, do let me know in the comments down below if you like any of them, which is your favourite one, are they all rubbish, do let me know. Um, but my favourite one was actually the one I took almost out of frustration, because um, I thought, if I hold it above my head, uh, surely I can't be in it then. Um, and it actually worked out alright with the tree branches and that sort of blue sky, nice sort of contrast, it was alright. It was all right, you know, good first attempt, good first attempt, not bad. So I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. It was a challenge and it was interesting. It was something different. Um, I think the more that I use it, the, like, the more ideas will come to me. It's a different way of thinking. It's a different perspective. And the more that I try to be creative with the lens ball, I think more ideas will come. I think it's kind of inevitable. It's sort of practice makes perfect. Um, the more that you're out there with it, thinking in that way, yeah, I think more ideas will uh, will come to me. Um, yeah, cheap, affordable, bit of kit, just go for it. Just honestly go for it. You may feel that you're not in like a creative uh, rut. You may not feel that you've hit a, a brick wall. Uh, in that case, maybe you can send me some tips. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Um, but yeah, if, if you feel like you're in a sort of creative block, you're a bit stuck, for ideas, even if you don't have a YouTube channel, even if you have no interest in video whatsoever, if it's just for you, photography, go for it. It's 20 quid. I mean, just go for it, honestly. Uh, you've got nothing to lose almost, I would say. Um, so yeah, for me, really enjoyable, can highly recommend it. It will certainly give you uh, a different perspective and definitely different photographs. Um, so yeah, all good. Thank you very much for watching this one. Uh, I do appreciate it and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.